Good evening, I'm Shamika Neely. The Chief Deputy Auditor of Jackson County faces charges of 10 counts of forgery and theft. 55-year-old Gwen Bohall has been arrested for allegedly stealing $7,600 in county funds since 2008. A state police investigation began in April after a Brownstown bank reported that Bohall had tried to deposit a Jackson County check into her personal account. She bonded out of the Jackson County Jail this morning. Spending cuts ordered ordered by Governor Daniels to keep the state in the black have legislative Democrats feeling uneasy. Daniels is ordering that state agencies find savings totaling 15 percent of their budgets. House Speaker Patrick Bauer says that lawmakers should have had more input into where cuts were made and that over the years legislators have allowed their authority over the budget to slip away. Calculations done by Purdue University professors suggest the BP oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico is more severe than authorities originally thought. Associate Professor of Mechanical Engineering Stephen Worley says he was able to use images from a webcam to calculate the rate of the oil flow, which he says is worse than the 1989 Exxon Valdez spill. Worley says on the positive side, the video of the spill has increased public outcry for more action for from BP officials. Ivy Tech, the state's largest community college, is moving forward with its largest project in history. The school broke ground on Wednesday, beginning the new construction of a state-of-the-art facility on the site of the former St. Vincent Hospital. Plans call for 155,000 square feet and additional space for classrooms, science and computer labs, and faculty offices. The space will be very beneficial to the school, seeing that the enrollment has quadrupled over the past 10 years years, finishing the spring of 2010 with more than 25,000 students. President Obama has nominated an Indiana native for a seat on the U.S. District Court for the District of Columbia. Robert Wilkins is a Rose Holman Institute of Technology alumni and has experience as a former special litigation chief for the District of Columbia and trial and appellate lawyer. Let's take a look at your weather tonight. Partly cloudy with a 30 percent chance of thunderstorms, lows in the mid 60s. Tomorrow, partly cloudy with a 40 percent chance of thunderstorms, highs in the mid 80s. And for more on these stories, please visit indianapublicmedia.org.